visualizing and representing fractions that are equal to 1 and greater than 1 using regions, sets and number line. Equal sharing is mostly done by each of us. We can easily make equal sharing of a whole or get equal some pieces of it if we know our fractions well. What is a fraction? Fractions represent the parts of a whole or collection of objects. A fraction has two parts, the numerator and denominator. The number on the top of the line is called the numerator. It tells how many equal parts of the whole or collection are taken. The number below the line is called the denominator. It shows the total number of equal parts the whole is divided into. Fraction of a whole. When the whole is divided into equal parts, the number of parts we take makes up a fraction. If a cake is divided into four equal pieces and one piece of the cake is placed on a plate, then each plate is said to have one quarter of the cake. It is read as one fourth or one by four. Fraction of a set of objects. There are a total of five sticks. 3 out of 5 are red. So, the fraction of red sticks is 3 fifths. 2 out of 5 are blue. So, the fraction of blue sticks is 2 fifths. 5 out of 5 are long stick. So, the fraction of long sticks is 5 fifths. Types of fractions. The primary parts of a fraction are the numerator and the denominator. Based on these, different types of fractions can be defined. Let us look at some common types of fractions. What is a proper fraction? Fractions for which the numerator is less than the denominator are called proper fractions. For example, if you order a pizza and cut it into four equal parts, and then eat one slice out of it, let's count the remaining pizza part. One, two, three. And that is your numerator. And your denominator is the number of parts of whole pizza which is four. The remaining pizza can be expressed as three-fourths of the whole pizza. Since three is less than four, the fraction is a proper fraction. What are the proper fractions of the following sets? Remember, a proper fraction is a fraction whose numerator is less than the denominator. What is an improper fraction? Improper fractions are defined as fractions for which the numerator is greater than the denominator. Let us take an example of improper fraction. Imagine you order a pizza that has four slices. Your friends eat all four slices. And you realize you didn't get any. You order another pizza. 
After eating one slice from it, you realize you are done eating. So, how much of the pizza did your friends and you have in all? Your friends first had all four slices of one pizza, and then you had one slice of the same size from the second pizza. Let's count all the eaten pizza. One, two, three, four, five. Five will be the numerator. Then there are four parts in a one whole pizza. Four will be the denominator. So, the total pizza eaten is five fourths slices of pizza. And that's an improper fraction with a numerator greater than the denominator. Mixed numbers. Another way of writing fractions greater than a whole. A mixed number has a whole part and a fractional part, which is actually a proper fraction. Let's take the same example. You and your friends ate one whole pizza and one fourth of a pizza. Since four fourths is equal to one. As a mixed fraction, we can write this as one and one fourths of a pizza. Remember, an improper fraction and mixed number form an equivalent. They represent the same fraction parts. Practice A. 1. Write the fraction for each shaded part on the blanks. Below are 4 and 3 fourths. The fraction 4 and 3 fourths is more than 4. We can see that 4 and 3 fourths is also 19 fourths. Practice A. 2. Below are 3 and 5 eighths. The fraction 3 and 5 eighths is more than 3. Write the fraction for each shaded part on the blanks. We can see that 3 and 5 eighths is also 29 eighths. Practice B. Write the fraction under each shaded figure. Give the improper fraction and mixed number shown by the shaded parts on the box. Practice C. Give the improper fraction and mixed number shown by the picture. Practice C. Give the improper fraction and mixed number shown by the picture.